talking about windows, so we want to talk about the things you need to consider when you need to get out there and buy your new windows. And because most homeowners are going to go through that at some point, whether you're doing an addition, whether you're putting in new windows in an old home, right. you know, or replacing and going brick to brick. But you know what I'm going to do? I'm so excited about this demo. I'm going to jump ahead and show you this Be Quiet window. It's a soundproof window. It's awesome from Encore Windows. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to simulate noise from the street. So you might live in a condo and you have all this noise happening. You know, soundproofing is important though, isn't yeah. I mean, I would think that this was one of the most important tips when you're getting windows. Well, you have to get a good night's sleep or how yeah. do you function the next day and you, you want to be productive. don't want to hear this. So watch this. Okay. There's Ooh, one. That's great. <gasps> isn't that amazing? That's amazing. You could be, like, you could be <laughs> at Young and Dundas in Toronto yes. and have your window open or right beside the Gardener, a highway. And yeah. if you have windows like this, you're okay. Yes. And this is, is amazing. An awesome, this is an awesome product. So what you could do if you're in a condo, because obviously windows in a condo are part of the common element. So it's not like you're going right. to be ripping out the windows and replacing. But you can actually put these windows on the inside if you're in a condo. Oh, so you can leave the smart. exterior windows and just put these on the inside and you have this beautiful soundproofed space. You know where else you need these? In your baby's nursery. Yes. <laughs> That's when you need these everywhere. Can you make the walls like this? Well, you know, what I always say to clients is that, you know, these are these are a little bit more money than your standard window, but right. absolutely worth the money. And so you don't have to spend money on the entire house. So, mm -hmm. for example, I have a busy street on one side of me. So why not spend the money on that side of the house? You know, and maybe I even do on the, maybe I do some beautiful wood windows on the front of the house, and then I do soundproof windows on one side of the house, and maybe on the side of the house that I have a neighbor that you know I never even go down that side of the house. Maybe I save money and do vinyl windows. Right. So there's all sorts of options. So I think homeowners go out and they think, oh well, I'm going to do vinyl windows throughout, or I'm going to do wood windows throughout, and you don't have to. You can mix and match. And so that's Very what smart. I'm here to talk about today. There's like five things you need to consider when you're doing your windows. Okay. So we know soundproofing is one of them. Consider yes. this if you are in a high noise area. You don't even have to then, turn it off because I can't hear it, Karen. <laughs> the noise is still Seriously. Going. <laughs> yeah, it's totally drowned out. Yeah. Okay, what amazing? else do we have here? So then the first thing we consider is how it's going to function. So right. most of us know this already, so I'm just going to kind of quickly go through. But there's everything from a casement, which is, you know, the big window that kind of cranks open. That's then, this one? Yes, casement. Uh -huh. Then you have single hung. And the difference between a single hung and a double hung is that a single hung, hung only goes up. So the top portion doesn't lower. Okay. So it only goes in one direction. The double hung, you can actually lower the top. So for example, say it was in a shower and you had lots of steam, mm -hmm. you might want a double hung so you can lower the top and let all that steam escape. Smart. So that's the double hung there where they both move. Yeah. We have More an awning. expensive, I'm assuming? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Um, then we have an awning style window. So that goes like that? Yes. That, you look at you, you're so smart. I don't know, I just felt <laughs> like it was going to be like an awning. And right? you know what, here's a little trick. These little dashed lines, whether it's on a window or on a cabinet, if you're looking at plans or elevations and cabinet design, mm. that's showing you where the hinge is. So this oh. is pointing to the hinge. Okay. So that's good to know if you're looking at cabinet designs as well. Yes. So that's an awning style window. We have slider windows. Right. And then we of course have, and everybody's seen bay windows, and they can be rounded or box bay. Yep. And then we have combos. So you could have a picture window. Picture windows are non-operating. And so they've got great R value. Um, they tend to be less expensive. And then you could actually pair them with something like a casement or a single or double hung. Okay. So that's the first thing Very to consider. Nice. How is it going to function? Right. Then the next thing to consider is how is it going to look? Yes. So we've got color and we've got SDLs or grills. That's that's the that's whatever's around exactly. it. Exactly. So we can pick a color. We can actually customize this and do any Benjamin Moore color. Oh, this is very nice. And this because a lot of people get stuck with the white yes, now, yeah. right? And it's just sticks and it can out be like stark. a sore thumb. Yeah. You know, particularly if you have a darker brick or an older brick, sometimes right. it's nice to blend in a little bit. And you can imagine how lovely this would look if you had a limestone path coming up your house and you have those beautiful gray tones. Yeah. And you continue that gray up the house. Beautiful. So, so that would be awesome. So, now, are there any materials that you get that you can't customize because of what it's made of? And that's the next thing. So, so we have the style, and the, right. and the thing is, everybody calls them different things. I would call this a cottage style window because we only have these kind of panes, these grills on the top portion of the window. Mm -hmm. And you've seen French where you have them all the way, and I would call a French window where they have them all the way down. And I tried to find some industry standard where everybody calls the styles the same, and the truth is, it doesn't really exist. So, right. just know what you like. Clip pictures from magazines, and then. Ideally, when you're thinking about grills, and here's an important tip as well, think about what you're looking out at. Like if you don't want to look through these mullions or look through these grills, maybe you don't want them at all. Mm -hmm. Or in this case, we put them up fairly high, so maybe you're standing and looking at it this portion, so you have a nice clear view here, but you get a little bit of the detail. Okay. So, so we've got all those, and then you get into all the options. So for example, like our Be Quiet window, the soundproof windows. Yes. So that's a coating. 
so you can do coatings. They even have coatings now that actually help to keep your windows clean. So they have self-cleaning windows now. So what is the coating? There's different laminates and different coatings you can get. Oh, so these so are they just coated the window, making it soundproof like well, that. Well, this particular, particular window is it's part of the process. It's part of a lamination process to okay. make this particular window. But for example, if you want a self-cleaning window, you can put a laminate on it to wait. Yes. Self-cleaning? Yes. That exists. So you can imagine if you had like a tall, you know, house and you you're on a busy street and you don't yes. want a ladder right every spring and clean your windows. Right. So How it does actually that work. If there's a lemon, it just kind of helps to shed the the, the dirt and it's everything amazing. off of it. And if you do get some dirt, it's like a, a light mist of a hose and whoosh, and there it goes. That is incredible. I didn't even know that existed. Yeah, it's amazing. Like the is there anything that will wash my dishes? Um, uh, if you could hire somebody. Uh, <laughs> no Just coatings. get back to me on that yeah. one. I found out about Encore Windows when my wife and I went to the home show. The main problem is the airplane noise. We absolutely love the neighborhood. We didn't want to move, uh, but sometimes at night, I'm, I'm the finicky one when I'm sleeping, I actually hear the big planes come in. We have exclusive rights to the Be Quiet soundproof window. It's a noise reducing window that eliminates noise. Anybody who lives in a high traffic area with airplane trains or buses or anything that creates a lot of noise, the Be Quiet window eliminates the noise anywhere between 75 to 90 percent. If you think of the only deterring factor is the occasional airplane noise, and if you're as picky as I am, it sometimes gets annoying. But the fact that you can you know, make a very small investment, get this done to your windows, and notice a dramatic uh, improvement in terms of what you hear. Uh, it's, it's unbelievable. What we've now done is we've made his windows um, virtually as soundproof as, as his actual walls. It was literally night and day. We would be woken up at night sometimes from a really loud plane. Now we can barely hear them. They came through. They actually did what they promised and uh, it's, it's very rare to see.
I'm Jackie Myers and I have Be Quiet Soundproof Windows. We live on a very busy street, so there's a lot of noise from construction, um, cars honking their horns, a lot of traffic, noise from a train. So we have a very young family who's keeping my kids up at night. Uh, we came across this site called Be Quiet Soundproof Windows and ever since we decided to get the windows installed it has been our best decision and our kids are finally sleeping. The day of the install the crew came in, they were very efficient, very professional and very clean and before you knew it the windows were installed. I highly recommend Be Quiet Soundproof Windows for anyone who's experiencing any kind of noise.